Release video shows an alleged kidnapping attempt in the North County. You can see the mother jump out of her car to confront the suspect. Our Jeff McAdams spoke with her today about this encounter. Yeah, people on social media are quick to point out, hey, maybe it was a mistake. Maybe this guy thought it was his car. Maybe he thought it was an Uber. Uh, Jennifer Lawson says not likely, and she thinks most parents probably would have reacted the same way. The video first surfaced on social media Thursday night when the sheriff's department posted it to Twitter. He um, comes out of nowhere. I just see him out of the corner of my eye um, walking by and looks into my window, and then I see him looking into Peter's window and opens up the door. As soon as he touched that handle, I jumped out as quick as I can. The footage coming from a car parked nearby was motion activated as Jennifer Lawson's fiance puts on the brakes before jumping out too. The Vista mom speaking to us Friday outside her home says her two year old and 10 month old were in the car. I've never been so scared in my life. Like I didn't know this guy's intentions. I didn't know what he was going to do. I didn't know who he was, if he had anything on him. I just reacted. Mama bear immediately. But others haven't seemed to be so understanding. The incident happening last Saturday in a Costco parking lot. Some have questioned whether the guy simply tried climbing into the wrong car on accident. In this video, the suspect, 37 year old Adam Galvanic, can be seen sitting on the ground in handcuffs with nearby customers yelling out. I get that if he did make a mistake, then. It was a bad mistake to make, um, but I don't, I deep down don't think he was making a mistake. You can clearly see in my car. So he looked in the window and saw him. According to the arrest report, Galvanic was under the influence of a controlled substance. The district attorney's office is considering charges. Lawson feels she did the right thing. I don't know what he was going to do, and I wasn't going to let, I wasn't going to sit in the car to see what he was going to do, and neither was my fiance. And while we wait to see what the DA does with these potential charges, this 37 year old suspect remains out of jail. He's posted $100,000 bail. From Bonzel, Jeff McAdam, Fox 5 News.